Hello, hello, hello. Hey, peeps. This is Diane. Cheers. Yeah. Cheers to you. Absolutely. This is Diana Randall Bro. That's us. We are here in lovely Pinion Oaks. Yep. In Prescott, um, Arizona. This is Pickle Lady. That's right. Prescott Pickle Lady. And you know what? We got some notes. Yeah. For those of you who are not in the business, notes are, hey, let me tell you, give you a little direction. So one of our clients gave me some notes and said, you need to explain what Prescott Pickle Lady means. Oh, okay. All right. I, I have do that. once or twice, but I'll yeah, cover it that. again. We've covered that. Um, I am the Prescott Pickle Lady because I make delicious New Orleans style Cajun pickles. So when you call me and we go out, I'll bring you some of my delicious Cajun pickles. That's right. People They're, started calling her the Pickle Lady. And right. Been the Pickle Lady ever since. And I'm cool with that. Yeah. At first I was embarrassed, but yeah. I'm okay. You can call me Pickles, Pickle Lady, yeah. whatever. Yeah. I respond to anything. Yeah, the pickles are good. And uh, yeah. the pickles are hot and spicy, sweet and garlicky all yeah. at the same time. So anyway, this is Randall Bro. I am Diane Bro with That's Prescott. Right. Huh? That's not right. I'm just agreeing with you. Okay. Are you going to interrupt me again? Absolutely. He keeps doing this. Yeah, that's what we do. All right. But anyway, <laughs> had a little bit of wine. Yeah, just a um, bit. Cheers. But anyway, we are There's with... something about my car. My car wants to be in the shot. I can't Is your move. car in the shot? Yeah. And uh, we are excited today. We are with some of our favorite clients. Absolutely. Hal and Linda Bray. Yep. They are transplanted Californians, and we are at their beautiful, beautiful home. Like and so many of our clients are. Yes, yes. Well, we figure they, these guys are like a role model for the whole state. They totally are, yeah. and so we are very excited to interview them today. Uh, Randall's going to get out of the shot because yeah, we can't fit all four of us. We can't fit all four of us. This popsicle stand, I'm going to blow it. That's right. But uh, we're going to have a good time. They're going to talk to you. You and see the car? You see the car? The, the see car the, attracts the camera. It's all right. Okay. All right. Anyway, um, they're going to talk to you about what it's like to move here to yep. Prescott Coal from yep. California and how great it's been. And yep. I, I just so admire them and their spirit and their go-to-ness. And yep. they're like, you know what? We're going to make this happen and we're going to start a whole new chapter in our life. So... So with, with that, that, she's ready to get rid of me that's and right. replace me with them. I don't so, want to talk to him anymore. Yeah, he, he, you guys have probably had enough. He's getting, well, you have like dappled sunshine on your face. I like <laughs> dappled. Dappled is good. Good word. Good word. I think, yeah, it's, he's got it's, it's, it's dappled like sunshine. Tasty. It's like tasty. But anyway, it's like an apple flavor, but only better. So in a second. Is that car again? That car is just attracting meet, the, All right, hush. Stop about the car because yeah. I had enough of that. All right, but anyway, in a second, you will meet Linda and Hal Bray. Can't wait to talk to you. All right, let me and get then, out of here. Bye. Bye. Cheers. 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 I am so very, very happy to introduce some of my favorite clients. This is Hal and Linda Bray. They came here straight from California. We are in their beautiful home here in Pinion Oaks. And look at the view over our shoulder. Uh, anyway, what I so love about them is just their spirit, their spunk, their outlook on life and they decided, you know what? We need to move. We need to make a change. And we're going to Prescott, Arizona. They came here cold. And uh, tell us about your going away party, about what some people said to you. Some people said, oh, we'll miss you so much, and others probably not, but um, <laughs> one of them. That's not true. <laughs> Thank God That's the bridge are moving. Yes. Yes. Thank God. <laughs> but one of them actually said, we're stuck here. We're too old to move. And I thought, ugh that really said it all so we were really glad that we did what we did not saying the boxing was fun but it was well well worth it so you do you yeah. find that it was terribly hard to do or, or you've just embraced the city right well right. All, all of a sudden it was it was when the boxes were emptied we thought oh now what and then we thought oh maybe i'll go sign up for a class maybe we'll join a group maybe we'll do this and that and it's been easier and easier and we get this every day so we're right. glad we did it right so, i get up every day and i look out from the porch mm -hmm. here and i say thank god i get to live in prescott oh i'm here um <laughs> perfect city you know we camped and hiked all over the country our whole life and when we look at prescott we said we've got to live there and uh, frankly, we wanted to leave California for a whole bunch of reasons, and I can't find anything that I don't love about living here. Oh, Absolutely. great. Absolutely. And you know what's great about them is they are joiners. They came here, they found their church group right away. Um, Hal has already been published with a letter to the editor. Right. <laughs> 
I mean, they jumped in. You do Tai Chi at the Senior Center. Um, and you know, it, it, it's kind of like what Hal said. You know what, if, if you can be president in your 70s, you can make a move and start a whole new chapter in your life. Absolutely. It's fine. Absolutely. It's not the end. It's just the start. It's the right. beginning. And, and there's a peacefulness here that you don't see in other places. Um, we, we went to Sedona twice since yeah, we've been, we've been here. 50 miles away in California, if you're going 50 miles away, plan on being on the road for two and a half hours. We went to Sedona in, a in an under, hour. In an, an hour. hour. Right. I was going to say a little under an hour, but we wouldn't speed. Right. Been <laughs> <anyway>. <laughs> but, but it was great. Right. <clears throat> part of being here, part of the pleasure of being here is, for example, my taxes, my property taxes, all my taxes are less than half what they were in California. So between the cost of living and what's here already in Prescott, now it's summer, we're into tourist season, we have fairs in the mall practically every weekend. It's a great place to be yeah, Lots of, lots of things to do. Lots right. of yeah, things I to mean, do. and yeah. these these are folks that came here. They have no family. They have no friends here, although we became friends. <laughs> we, we have a lot of fun with them. Um, um, but they came here and truly have had to restart it's like a brand new chapter right. and they've completely embraced it and they said there's so many things to do between the hiking you know everything else they go to the uh, senior center uh, they've joined the Y um, I mean don't be afraid correct right. absolutely what do we say just do just it just do it just Jump do in. it just do yeah it. I think part of that part of what makes it easier is you have to think a little bit before you actually make the move and if you plan a little bit um, the move itself is not that hard. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. They made a couple of visits. We had fun looking at houses. <laughs> we and really did. Houses, yeah. We really did. <laughs> and and they ended up buying this beautiful home here with great views. And um, you know, I just admire their courage, really, because to me, it's really scary to start over and leave your family. You left your son and your granddaughter, who I know you love and adore. But guess what? She comes and visits, and it's a one-hour flight from L.A., and they're making it work. Right. Yeah, and we actually use the regional airport. Mm -hmm. um, I went last month to see my granddaughter, and the little regional airport here has flights to L.A. daily, flights coming home, so we made that work. Right. It's nice. Right. It's really it's nice. nice. Right. So mm -hmm. I applaud you, and um, I'm just so glad that uh, you became our client, and now you're our <laughs> friends. And uh, I just admire everything you've accomplished, and I just think you're awesome. Thank you. Thank we you. think you're awesome too. <laughs> we think yes. you're awesome too. So right. cheers, <laughs> and thank you for agreeing to be part of our wind down. Absolutely. Yeah. So if you're thinking, ah, oh, maybe my ship has, you know, sailed. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm not in the right age anymore to do this. You were wrong. Correct. 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 You Absolutely. need to do it and make it happen, Captain. Right. Right. No regrets. No, no regrets. regrets at all. No uh -huh. regrets. So thank you, Linda and Hal Bray. Well, I, I'm not going to give you your address. <laughs> <laughs> but our sale is. But stop know. in any time, right? But stop in any time. They have a great front porch here. We're enjoying the views and having some good mm -hmm. wine and just, just having a good time visiting. So listen, if you're worried and like, oh, maybe it's too late for me, it really isn't. Mm -hmm. Just what? Just, just do, do it. it. Cheers. Cheers. All right. Thanks, guys. Have a good day. Talk to you soon. Bye.